I'm Dan Horton, renovated Nippert Stadium. Our coverage of Bearcats training camp continues now with starting left tack tackle Parker Anger. All league is a right guard last year, now protecting Gunnar Keel's blindside at left tackle. Is that a difficult adjustment? Uh, you know, really it hasn't been a difficult adjustment, you know, because I, I came in as a left tackle and, you know, I played right tackle my first two years and then, you know, I, I've been I've been able to play, you know, wherever they needed me to and, you know, it's just a it's just a quick transition for me back to left tackle and, you know, I like being out there on an island and being able to protect Gunner, you know, because I go around telling people, you know, as, as we're best friends, you know, I go around telling them, you know, I protect him too for a living, so. <laughs> what happens when your best friend gets sacked or hit and you're the guy that's protecting his blind side? Oh, I mean, if I mean, if I'm the one that gave it up, you know, I'm going to take the blame for it. But if someone else is giving up, I'm going to be the one getting on them for it. Parker, there's been a lot of talk this season about how the offense has seven top seven wide receivers back, three of the top four running backs back. But there are some changes on the offensive lines. A couple of uh, starters graduated as you get ready for the season. What's the biggest thing that you have to work on? Is it communication? Is it footwork? What is it? Uh, you know, I'd say being more of like a vocal leader, you know, it's definitely, you know, as as a young guy in the past, you know, I let the seniors and older guys and captains, you know, st uh, step up and, you know, be vocal leaders. And, you know, last year I, I wasn't as vocal of a leader as I sh probably should have been. You know, I was going to let the guys like Eric Layfeld and Kevin Schlomer and them, you know, step up and do their part and wait for my time as a senior. And now that it's come, you know, I, as, a, as a senior captain, you know, I want to I want to be able to voice my opinion. You know, when I think the team needs it, you know, when I think the team needs to, you know, bounce back from, you know, something, you know, when something happens, you know, they need to be able to bounce back and recover. So I you know I want to be a better vocal leader this year and, you know, help the team out when they need it. So you're practicing against the first team defense almost every day. Do you see a noticeable difference this year as compared to last year? Uh, yeah, and that's, I mean, I've told quite a few people is, you know, our, uh, our defensive line at this point, you know, looks a lot better than what they did last year coming out of higher ground. And, you know, I'm excited about that. That's that's real good, you know, going in the first, I mean, we have a, you know, another week and a half of practice, you know, for them to get better before the first game. But, you know, our, de our defensive line looks great, and that's good news. So here we are at Nippert Stadium 15 days before you play your season opener. What's it going to mean to you to run out of that tunnel in your senior year? You know, I think it's going to mean everything. You know, I've, I've been waiting for this moment, you know, for, uh, you know, pretty much since December 5th, you know, 2013. You know, we lost to Louisville in the last closing seconds of the game. And, you know, they talked that at that point they were talking about renovations to, to Nippert. So I kind of knew that we weren't going to be playing in the NIP for my junior year. So I waited, you know, I've, I've been waiting two, in two years in the making for to run back out of the NIP. And, you know, I think it's going to be everything, you know, just a climax of my senior year. And I think it's going to all, all uh, come together, you know, running out for the first game against Alabama and AM. As we sit here and look around, what do you think? I mean, it looks great. You know, I, I couldn't have asked for anything better. You know, I, I, I love the stadium as it was in the first place, but now they did this, this amazing renovations and I couldn't have asked for anything better. All right, we can't wait. Best yep. of luck this year. Thanks for the time. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. All right, that is all-league offensive lineman Parker Anger, and I'm Dan Horde. Th thanks for checking out this training camp report here on Bearcats TV.